L D M M A C. Y'all know I was going to talk about this one. I mean, it took a little time. But you guys knew that I was going to eventually come back to this. So Kat Zingano, man, she ducked Chris Cyborg to fight Pam Sorsen. Or, okay, so Kat says that she's going to fight Chris Cyborg in March, March 11th. <sighs> Where do I start with this? Where do I start with this? Now, you know, before I start this video, you know, Kat Zingano is looking looking a little kumsi Um And the coach can see. Um, many of you can see what the coach sees. But the coach can see. You can tell me what you see. And the coach will give you a heart if you see the right thing. But anyway, let's get back to what we were talking about. Okay? Kat Zingano. Duck Chris Cyborg to fight Pam Sorsen. Guys, we, 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 we know this. We can't get around this. So Chris Cyborg is going to be at the fight. Okay? And you better bet your bottom dollar Chris Cyborg is going to come into the octagon ring. She's going to walk into that ring. If Kat Zingano is victorious, she's going to walk into the octagon ring and tell Kat Zingano to her face that you are afraid to face me. See, the reason why I'm going to go hard on Kat Zingano because Kat Zingano for years, for over five years, said that she was going to whoop Chris's ass. Kat said it. I don't know why everybody's afraid of Chris. She's beatable. She can't handle me. Now, Kat Zingano talked a gang of sh I'm talking for years, y'all. Big and Dana White when they were both in the UFC. I'll fight Chris Cyborg. I want to fight Chris Cyborg. But then guess who she fought? She took a fight with Megan Anderson. Had a chance to fight Cyborg. Fought Megan Anderson. And then you lost to Megan Anderson. <laughs> I said, damn. I said, boy, when it rains, it pours for damn Kat Zingano. i tell you this. When it rains, it pours for Kat Zingano. She can't get right. She can't get right. She can't get it right. So then she went to Bellator. Fought Gabrielle Holloway and... I don't know, she fought somebody else that she beat up on, and, oh, okay, now it's Pam Bam source. You know what? I'll be pulling for Pam Bam. Let me take a sip of some of this little brew I got. Ah, boy, that's tasty. But you can bet your bottom dollar that, 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 that if Pam Source and wins, I'm a clown cat Zingano to the end of time. Now, of course... Chris Cyborg would have to end up fighting Pam Sorsen if, if Pam Sorsen is victorious. I like Pam, you know. I know it's the fight that we wouldn't want to see, but it's a fight that I will I'll watch. Okay? We want to see Chris Cyborg and Kat Zingano go head to head. Let's just put it out there, okay? Chris Cyborg is going to whoop Kat Zingano ass, okay? That, that's just what's going to happen. I done told y'all and told y'all the cat did not want that problem. Kat Zingano, you know, first time I yeah, when I get to Bellator, I'm going to go whoop Chris' ass. She get to Bellator, no, nah, she don't want to fight Chris. Kat Zingano tell me she need a tune-up fight. She need to fight a couple of fights before she fight Chris Cyborg. Like, which one is it? Which one is it? Kat Zingano full of sh That's what she is. That's what she is. Chris Cyborg is going to retire Kat Zingano. Kat Zingano trying to take as many phases as she can not name Chris Cyborg because she know that the end of her career is when she fights Cyborg you know and I know that the end of her career is when she gotta fight Cyborg she done she, it's over Chris gonna put this girl in the hospital man Kat, see Kat Zingano wrote a check that her ass couldn't cash she wrote a check that her ass couldn't cash and she wrote a check because she finna get her ass whooped Chris Cyborg is going to break her foot in Kat's ass. She's going to kick Kat right in the ass and break her foot off in it. Like, you know, I don't mind you talking junk and you have every intention of fighting the champ. But then it's when you talk all the noise. It's when you talk so much noise. You talking noise after noise after noise. And then you don't, and then you don't fight the champ after you talked all that shit. Nah, cat. We 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 not trying to hit this, cat. We not trying to hit this. 
No, you get your ass in that octagon. Then you tell me you want to fight in March? No, 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 no. Who the hell want to wait till March to watch you get your ass whooped by side? But we don't want to wait till March. Nobody wants to do that. Can't nobody cares what you think. Yeah, and, and, and you know what? And, and to be honest, I hope Pam Shores some win because I, I'm sick of cat. I'm sick of cats in Ghana. If you don't want to fight the damn champion, and Scott Coker already, you, you know, you the title shot was yours. Scott Coker already said the title shot was yours. And it's like you think you got the audacity. You think you need another fight before you fight for the belt. I mean, the nerve of this girl. The nerve of her. I mean, can't you like 40 years old now? Time for you to retire. Should have retired a long time ago. But that's okay. That's okay. Maybe Pam Sorensen might retire you. Maybe Chris Cyborg might retire you. Hell, I don't know. But I do know it's time for you to get your ass up out of here, okay? Get all the way out of here. Get, get, get out of here. Nobody's buying the story, cat. We all know. We know what it is. We know that. We know you didn't want that Cyborg work. We know you didn't want no work, no smoke from Chris Cyborg. You didn't want it. You didn't want it. You didn't want the smoke. You try to, you know, talk yourself up as if you wanted to smoke. And then when the house catch on fire, <laughs> you ain't trying to go put the fire out. You're trying to run from the fire. You're trying to run out of the house instead of going out there to put that fire out. What Chris Cyborg finna set you on fire? Oh, she gonna set you on fire and she's going to suffocate you with the smoke. You see Kat Zingano, tick-tock, tick-tock, tick-tock. We know what it is. We know what it is. Okay, we know who it is and we know what it is. And it's definitely not you. Be ready, y'all. Be ready. This woman is going to take the last ass woman of her career. And I hope she come out on, I hope that she come out okay. But chances are she's not.